after the battle. I've been looking for you. Like I used all my vulnerabilities on on to do. I was hoping we could all share a meal together. It could serve as both a victory celebration and a post-battle analysis. What do you think? Of course. Why wouldn't you be? Gotcha. Come now, Professor. We can't very well celebrate without the key to our victory present. I'm a key? I wanna, right. Are you it my lock? Is. We were only able to win because we had your help, Professor. Yes. Compared with that boar who knows nothing save frontal attacks, your tactics were nearly decent. Felix, you really ought to stop picking fights with His Highness. Don't worry, Ingrid. I encourage all to speak freely. And I must agree that the Professor's tactics were truly extraordinary. I have much to learn. We can work on that. Oh, sure. But today was exhausting. I'm so hungry I can barely stand. To be honest, so am I. Let's head to the dining hall. Together. Professor, I'm sorry to intrude, but... You don't look too happy for someone who just won. You say that, but your eyes tell a different story. Oh, you know me already, Dimitri. I know we only just met, so this may be difficult for you, but... I'd love nothing more than to share our happiness with you. Joy can be so fleeting, after all. We're all in this together. So, I hope you will consent. Oh, you know I will. I'm sure the rest of the class feels the very same. Well, come along, Professor. Let's enjoy the fruits of our labor. Aye, aye, Captain. Your work with the students was remarkable. I can see Geralt trained you well. I do hope you were able to use the occasion to bond with the students. I'm so happy to hear it. Nothing would please me more than if you used this coming year to grow closer still. Of course, the mock battle was mere practice. The real fight is the battle of the eagle and lion, which will take place during the wyvern moon. You are expected to properly train your students so as not to humiliate the academy during the long-held tradition that is the coming battle. No pressure. We'll be fine. As for today, I have called you here to tell you of your mission for the month ahead. Your class is to dispose of some bandits causing trouble nearby. Kill them? Those affiliated with Garrig Mach Monastery have a moral obligation to help those in need, regardless of social standing. Students are no exception. Each month before the newly birthed moon departs, each house of students must complete their assigned mission. You shall work to complete the task at hand alongside your students and report back to the Archbishop before the deadline. Understood. So is this where I should do everything I want before? and then wait to do the quest like the day before. I will soon provide you with the necessary details for your first mission. If I told you now, I expect you would only forget and I despise repeating myself. I can sense something special within your heart. I have high hopes for you. Bandits, they say. Oh, I forgot about little sister in our brain. Do you recall when we first met? You shall not fall so shamelessly again, correct? Have you no words for me? Do not tell me that you are shocked to hear from me! <laughs> you ought to know that I am always with you now. To hear my voice should not come as a shock. Are you Jesus? Nonsense. All I was told was to kill as many noble pipsqueaks as possible. What? No one said anything about the Knights of Dan Saros being on our trail. You have proven yourself worthless, distracted by something so trivial. 
Oh, do we get to make, meet our antagonist? I had hoped you would achieve your goal despite the setback. But now a child of the night's former captain is in play. How interesting. Hey, this isn't what I agreed to! Hiring a mercenary as a professor. What was that woman thinking? Are you listening to me? How do we finish this? You die. What? What? Underestimating the knights was an amateur mistake. One you will pay for. The road to eternal torment awaits you all. Now I must locate your replacements. Wait! Get back here! Damn you! Well, sucks for him. Part one, white clouds, harp string moon, familiar scenery. My voice is so soothing. Her of the saints whose births or deaths took place. I did. This moon. Dimitri was too hot. Music once beloved by those divine beings. Whether by harp, by flute, or voice alone, joyous melodies are shared between farmers as they sow their seeds across the vast plains of Teltin and Grander. Well, it's not bad himself, but Dimitri just. Mwah. As you have already been notified, your mission <laughs> is to subdue some bandits. I don't know, if I got neutered, I'm I'm pretty sure I'd be like a dog and just sit in one area sulking all day and just get really, really overweight. So there wouldn't be a cutie here for, for that much longer. Dreams are going well. Um We're really enjoying this game so far. It's still early. Um but if you haven't been here in a while, we're raising money for the Trevor Project as well. And we're getting close to our one year on Twitch, so we're excited. Thick boys even <laughs> I have a feeling that there's nothing I could do to get you, get you to stop coming around here, Koa. I try. Our students have been learning about combat through study, but this is a precious opportunity to provide them with practical experience. The knights will support your mission and are prepared to offer their assistance if necessary. I'm okay with that, Koa. I'm a okay. In short, this is no mock battle. You must be prepared for anything. You will receive a message from the knights when it is time to depart. Until then, use your time wisely. This will be our first true battle. I'm looking forward to fighting alongside you, Professor. Dimitri, just come to my quarters, please. During the mock battle, your commands were thoughtful and thorough, as was your strategy. With you on our side, I'm confident we will prevail. Thankfully, Brooksy has the uh, mod privileges to get around auto mod. It seems we have some time to spare before our departure. Let's use this opportunity to prepare as best we can. You seem well. Are you adjusting to life at the monastery? I want Dimitri in my quarters, not Gerald. Dan! Dan, I'm supposed to have playtime here. Oh, I didn't expect that answer. When we were mercenaries, I handled everything. I expect nothing less. Outside of battle, you didn't have much contact with people, did you? I thought being thrown into a swarm of noble brats to teach would be a bit much for you. But I guess I had nothing to worry about. By the way, I heard about those bandits. Your first assignment is to take them out, right? That's fairly routine for you by now, but don't forget it's the first real taste of battle for those brats. It'll be tougher to sleep at night if you let one of your little pupils die. So stay vigilant and lead them well. Do you want to be a wine cola? I wish I could offer you my support, but Lady Rhea won't allow it. For now, I'll try to figure out what she wants from you. I don't mind you settling into your life here, but don't let your guard down, ever.
What? That was our whole day? That was our whole week? Come on, let me have some fun. Thank you. Well, of course we have to explore. What's on the marketplace? We need some more Volinaries for sure. Power! Yes, we'll get you some power. What are the seals for? Ooh. Hopefully he'll teach us at some point how to use those. Ooh, I don't think we have a rogue or anything. Let me buy a key. Oh, I should probably put that on uh, on my main character. Why do I have two iron swords? Is that does he dual wield them or not? And how do I compare this to the other weapon? Oh, I have three in stock. Who has all the steel swords? Uh, I'm stuck with with iron. Shits and giggles? Wait, for which part? <laughs> you get better stories as your leader episode set? Okay. But who has all the, uh, who has all the better stuff? I guess we'll figure that out as we go. I must, oh, right. Oh, hello, I like you much better like this. That's what I want to hear as soon as I see them. This isn't good. When is our mind not in the gutter? Would you kindly do something for me? Okay, she has the voice of a grandma, but she looks like she's in her twenties. Collect recipes? Of course I have time to collect recipes for you. Definitely like Ash. And Sil- Ooh, Sylvain is a hottie too. Yes, yes, let's have some boy time. This looks delicious. Let's eat. Yeah, you just get it, Professor. This is my favorite. This part reminds me a lot of Persona. Yo, Harax, how are you, honey? It's so good to see you. How you been? 
You look delicious, dear. How you been? Sylvanus straight, so fair warning. I know, but we can still thirst. I'm sure Ashes straight too, I'm sure. Hell yeah, we do. Um if anybody doesn't know Haraxment, he streams as well, and he's the person that did our sub badges. He was so gracious to offer to do them. So we have to thank him every time we see him. With that being said, no one listen guys. Don't leak people's nudes. It's not cool. What? I want my nudes everyone. Everywhere. <laughs> That's personal. I I definitely do. I have to support such an amazing person. I but can't thank you enough. You with that About a, a pound for every time a guy slept with somebody straight, I'd be rich. Damn, Brooksy. <laughs> it's a lot of straight guys you sleep with. I appreciate you. I've got to find out everyone's likes and dislikes so I know what to cook. Who knows when it'll be my turn at kitchen duty. How about you, Professor? Do you like sweet or spicy food? How have things been with you? Uh, last time we talked, I don't think things were going that great, but I think you were you were getting over a breakup, and I think things were improving. We haven't caught up in a bit. Ooh, same. I'll definitely remember that. Straightness, gross. <laughs> wait, wait, aren't you straight? Or am I mistaken? Pan, got it. Wait, I thought you were dating a good girl. Bridget has much more warmth than Fodlin. Even Spring here has coolness. And you, Professor? Which do you find is worst? Too hot or too cold? But you are wearing many things, Professor. <laughs> if you are not liking the heat, you should be wearing lighter clothes. Um, can't you see I just took all my clothes off, Petra? Already done. Training has given me great busyness, right? But you have given me in Ugh. She values riding, huh? That's interesting. Dexterous riding. Got it. She was super dense after a, until after a story event. Okay. Welcome back, Travis. How was uh, how was shopping? Well, it's fair if people think I'm straight considering I'm trying to finish. Hey, the only reason I thought it was because I knew you were dating a a woman. <laughs> now let's not slut shame. Good. Welcome back. Welcome back. A little bit poorer. Regardless of age. Yes, I'm actually very busy right now. Why is nobody interested in me? I swear I'm hot. Well, there's one of our possible love interests. Professor, how are you today? I'm just heading out for a mission. I'll be seeing you. <laughs> I have the same problem. Everybody's so hot and I just want all of it. I don't need luck. This will be a piece of cake. I'll be back before you know it. I know you're in MMOs, Rex. Have you uh have you picked up New World and how are you liking it if you did? Accompany you on your assignment. We don't want anything to happen to our precious students. If any of you run into trouble, we'll step in and help out. Gotcha. What? You look bored. Care to do? This kind of looks like the guy that was uh, that was hiring the bandits. What? What? What I wanted to, I wanted to duel. Why was that a no? Ooh, that's that's exciting. Greetings, Professor. Nothing to report. 
I have too many MMOs on my plate right now. I can't afford Is another one. Here at the monastery yet? Make sure to have a good look around. There's much to see. Like fish. You do know about the Thank you, Brooke C. The dining hall, right? You can fish there. You might as just joining us. Yes, we are raising money for an amazing cause called the Trevor Project. There's a link. All the bots are broken, sorry. So, uh... We've been manually copy pastas. Alright, I already went shopping. Welcome. Oh, hello. We love a man in uniform. <laughs> it's the uprising, yes. Yes, we're all about to have to take up arms. Now, I think it's mostly just Streamlabs. It's been down for a couple days now. Can you pet the animals? I tried. I don't think we can. No, that's unfortunate. I want to steal all the animals and put them all in my house. That's cool. Hi there. I know. They can make people so much more happier just by letting them pet the the poor little poor little petsies. Bad? That was all good and excellent. What are you talking about? Apparently don't have sex with me. I don't have rhythm. Queen Loach. <laughs> good, good, I'm glad. Might just have to put on some music to actually have a any kind of rhythm. That's that looked like tetanus roach. I don't want that. I can throw that right back in. Five star. All right, we're gonna have to find a master baiter. Demir. Have we met? Oh, well, we have another sexual uh, clip. Yay! That's all we have. No, sorry. You were mine. <laughs> That's all you had to say to me? Uh, hello. Um, if you'll excuse me. Oh, Professor. Wait, isn't Marianne hello. already part of our party? Excuse me. I, I thought she was.
I thought we could plant multiple. Maybe not. Run by clips, you have no rhythm and only last two minutes really selling yourself there? Hey. You know what you're getting yourself into, at least. That was probably a waste of money, but we'll see what we get. <laughs> oh, come on. That was rude. Um, sorry. I'm, I'm always gonna be a stranger if you never leave your your dorm. Oh, professor. Hello. I was just looking for my Well, it's it's like a pale blue cloth. Have you seen uh, I do find you hmm. Apparently I say the wrong things a lot. It's like real life. Captain Gerald is. That's enough, Leo. <laughs> if I don't know, how could my child know? It's not normal to forget your own age, you know. It's kind of worrisome, actually. By the time you're forgetting your own age, you're past the point of caring. I guess if you put it that way, you've got a point. Oh, you're senile. I have a request. Sir, with this month's mission, you can now lead a battalion into battle, search for the tactics primer in the captain's quarters, and pursue it to get up to speed. Okay. With issue two, I'm usually just as surprised as everyone else at the comments that come out of my mouth. <laughs> exactly. Alright, how do we get... All right, new area, cool. Speaking of cuties. So many hot streamers. For years, the Boar, Prince, and I were inseparable. I know him better than almost anyone else. So let me give you some advice. Beneath all that princely polish, he's an M, nothing more. He's strong and skilled, sure, but don't place your trust in him as a human being. Take care he doesn't chew you up and spit you out. That sounds hot. Felix Sylvain and I have known each other since we were children. His Highness as well. Though I should warn you that both Felix and Sylvain are a bit challenging at times. I'd take Sylvain. The moment I take my eyes off them, they're off causing all kinds of trouble. It's always been that way. Hey there, Professor. You here to check in on my training? Something like that. Oh, that reminds me. I found this small... Ah, is it weird. blue? Not really sure what it is, but it works. Um, I know where your cloth is. Here to no? The next assignment is to drive out bandits? So tell me something, Professor. When it comes to a one-on-one -on -one battle, which is better? You might be right, but when it's all set... Damn it, I say the wrong things to the wrong people. Good to see. I was just on I need to start saying what they expect to hear and not what I think. Hey there. Let's see. That person sure does remind me of somebody. Oh. Do you need me for something? I love you, Rob. How are you? I think everybody here knows Rob, but if you don't, go give him a follow. He'll be back in I do January. Not do this for the bits, the cheers, 
none of that. The subs, like, I can't tell you how great it is. Work is shit. Work is always shit. I do bring a smile to somebody. You're working on the weekend? That mission is completely accomplished. Why are you working on Saturday? Do you always work on Saturday? Do I just not know this? Even members of the church are forbidden from entering without permission. To go trampling around in there, causing trouble. Those bandits truly are morally reprehensible. Okay. I saw that you uh, you guys put in an application on a house. I'm excited to, excited to hear that it goes through. Congratulations, my love. Now, as long as you have two days off a week, I wouldn't mind working Saturdays either. It means I could get to do other things while everybody's at work. Thank you for paying me a visit. Was it super nice? Is there anything troubling you? Or is there perhaps something I can help you with? Believers live their lives by her sacred wisdom. Please use the library's vast resources to learn more. I can often be found here, so if there is ever anything... Ah, uh, dedicated stream room, that's awesome. I'm so excited for you. Technically, I have a dedicated stream room here, but it's, it's also our spare bedroom. So I don't exactly have that much room to work with. I wish I had a bigger room. Like I have a queen size bed right here, and then what's behind me, that's pretty much it. I wish I had room for a VR. Or... Work guiding the students in the mock battle. Taking command like that? But I shouldn't be complaining. I really shouldn't complain. And bearing the unknown crest's power? Yes, I'm talking about you. That's awesome. Yeah, we're like, yeah, we need we need a spare bedroom for when we have company. It's been over a year. We've never had anybody over. <laughs> but it's there in case it's needed. Your talents are incredible, and Lady Rhea's insight as to your potential is doubly so. We technically have a three-bedroom house. But the one on the first floor is so small, it would barely fit a twin, and I use that for my my work. My work office. And then this spare bedroom is the stream room. So technically we're only really using one bedroom out of the three. Have me over? Absolutely. Look, you guys can all have fun in the stream stream room. You know, we can we can turn this into an OnlyFans stream room. We need an L-shaped desk would be wor nice. I really didn't want to mix up my my play and work offices, so uh, I made sure my work is is way downstairs. We have a three uh, three story townhome, and uh, it is garage and office on the first floor, living room on the second, and the bedrooms on the third. So it's nice and separated. I'm so glad to be a student here. Only friends, yes. I get to use this library. Only friends with benefits. Hey, you make it work. It's it's gonna be an improvement over what you have currently. I know I know between work and streaming you were like sitting in the same chair for almost your entire day. So I'm I'm glad you're gonna get a little bit more space. Reading books from all the regions of Fodlan? I feel almost like I'm visiting those places myself. Oh, I agree. They're brimming with the knowledge and experience of our ancestors. Ah, Professor, I'd like to learn more about you. I'm gonna recruit all of you eventually. Oh, there's glowing points. Uh, I love collecting books. Thank you for this. Uh, 
Oh, Cola, you're already recruited. Swimming through a sea of countless books, tracking down that single sought after volume. It's absolute bliss. How do the poor fools who spend their days sharpening swords and polishing armor find any joy in life? Huh? York? However, I still have a lot of Nobody wants to be part of my my guild. What's the glowing purple stuff? Is that just more books to read? I think I've read all of these. I don't know why it's so glowing purple. Yeah, I've, I've definitely read these. Oh, it's just my icon. Doop doop doo doo. Oh, that was part of a quest. Okay. Hey, look, the Streamlabs bot is back. What the hell? Oh, look at that. Look at that. They came online. Nice to see you again, Mr. Streamlabs. Lazy. Just kidding. I love you. Don't leave me again. How do we get... How do we get there? Oh. Now it works. Really? Hmm. Do you know of the Iyer family? We have long held Dad? the prime minister in the empire. The empire's power lies with six noble families. My family foremost among them. Of course. The full explanation may be time consuming. I can give you a moment to get ready, if you would like to All right, I will list the six great noble families. There's Kaspar's father, Count Burgles, the Minister of Military Affairs. Then there's Linhart's father, Count Hevering, the Minister of Domestic Affairs. Bernadetta's father, Count Varley, is the Minister of Religious Affairs. Jesus Hubert's Christ. Hubert's father, Marquis Vestra, is the Minister of the Imperial Household. Finally, we have Duke Gert, the Minister of Foreign Affairs. And my own father, Duke Iyer, the Prime Minister. Just trying to command a route again. Now, 530,000 block bots? Holy crap. One day, I will take his place as the Prime Minister of the Empire. Good on you for being proactive. I am more talented than anyone in my class, even Edelgard. I will lead the Empire to a bright, enlightened future. Well, now that the bot's working, there's a PSA, um... I've been posting my single player playthroughs on YouTube. If anybody would be so kind to to follow. I also do streaming every once in a while. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers so I can actually monetize the channel. There is nothing I cannot achieve. <laughs> I hear the Officers Academy of the Monastery was founded about two centuries ago. Do you actually call out? I don't, I don't know if I've ever seen you come to one of my uh, live streams on YouTube. Although I, I don't understand YouTube's live streaming that much either as a viewer. I don't get notifications and it's kind of hard to tell when somebody's live. But I need to use it more to, to learn. Uh, it's a thousand subs and I think four thousand watched hours. You came into it once? Oh, thank you, dear. Oh, I remember now. Yes. Yes, yes, I remember that. 
The eastern region of Fodlan was being invaded by Almira, and so the Archbishop of the time took measures to prevent the border from being taken. Yeah, I think to clarify has it right, it's a thousand subs and four thousand hours watched. In order to ensure Fodlan would be safe from potential threats, she deemed it necessary to raise a generation of excellence. Yeah, I hate spamming Discord with it, because I... That is how the establishment was founded. The I really hate sending out over the years. sending out Discord notifications. Um, I am at 86 subs and about a thousand hours, I think. I got a long way to go, but I'm trying to build it up slowly. Almost all of my hours come from shorts. My shorts get between 12 and 15,000 views every time I post. I have a favor to ask. My videos, none. <laughs> Absolutely zero. As a gaming channel, I have so such a hard time thinking of things to our videos to do that's not just gameplay. I don't I don't know where people come up with ideas. Oh, thanks, dear. I appreciate that. Oh, professor, did you come to pray to the goddess? I think my best videos are actually from a game I started when I first started uh, streaming. I don't think any of you were here. Besides Shammy, I think Shammy was lurking. But it is a game called Blackguards. It's nobody plays it, nobody streams it. It's a D and D strategy game. Uh, kind of like, kind of like this. But uh, actually, putting those walkthroughs up, those those are actually some of my my best videos. Even though nobody actually plays it. There's the clickbait titles. You know it. You know it. Shall we pray together? So. Inside the cathedral, there is a chapel dedicated to the four saints. Do you know of them? Saint Indec, Saint Macuel, Saint Keyhole, and... <laughs> Keyhole. Saint Sathleen! Who is your favorite, Professor? Now that you are a member of the church, be sure to familiarize yourself with our teachers. I don't like these church members. It's gonna be interesting playing that storyline. I have something to ask of you. Inside the cathedral, Saint Saint now that oh, that's this person you talk to. Nope, this one. It is the duty of every Fodlan noble to demonstrate piety towards Seros. Have you also come to offer your prayers to the goddess, Professor? You don't sound terribly Excuse sure. me? Perhaps you are not of noble birth? After all, devotion is not as essential for a commoner. Technically, I'm a commoner, but fuck you, Lorenz. Jesus. It would seem it's a I don't want to recruit you. You zealot. Okay, I didn't really think. What was up with uh, this quest? Bar practice. I mean, we have to sing. Here's an idea. Hey, you. Hey. I'm so glad they gave us this little world to explore instead of just throwing us from one battle to another. The Knights of Saros are also known as the Shining Knights. We are the sword and shield of the Divine Saros. There are many orders of knights in the world, but we are the only one that has the honor of bearing the name Saros. As a member of the church, you should probably study up on the history of Saros and the knights. 
Hi, Sylvain. Hi, Daddy. Our first assignment is to take out some bandits. Did anyone tell Lady Rhea that people's lives are at stake? I lost my own brother to bandits. Uh, this is your purpose, right? Is something are you scared? Said at some point, I'm sure. <laughs> okay. Wow. You sure are pretty, but damn, you're insensitive. Myra, Dusker, even people from far off lands gather here at the academy. Word of advice, Professor. There are those who don't think kindly of such people. We don't take kindly to your camera out here. It's thanks to my adoptive father, Lenato, that a commoner like me is here at the academy. He is the very model of chivalry. Someday, I'm going to be just... Oh, Ash is so cute. I love him. I've heard your class is hunting thieves. That mission is very different from the one we were given. Oh, which, what do you have? You're quite powerful to have beaten us in the mock battle. Such a shame you aren't leaving. Not yet, at least. Okay. Hello. What the? Mm, let me see. What are you doing out of the library? Do you know about the Cardinals? They are the ones who run the church. Their identities are a closely guarded secret. Uh. At least the music is super relaxing. I'm bored. Maybe I should go into town. But that would be such a hassle. Hi, Professor. I'm rather busy right now, so do make it quick. Damn. <laughs> I suppose being a professor has taught you how to ferret out time wasters. Slap back. Professor, but if... Ooh, a gazebo. You know, Professor... There are some things I'll just Oh, of course Manuela would be here. Trying to trying to grab a couple and uh like to do some night, I went on a date with a dashing, handsome, strong young knight. Oh, I'm a bit weak just remembering him. Anyway. Manuela is totally me in female form. Do you know what that no good jerk said when we got back to my room? He said, what a mess. I'm afraid to go in there. Where was he looking? Leave it. You know who cares about keeping everything neat and tidy? Not me. That's who. Afraid to go in there. <laughs> night he is. Have you played this show? Oh, Ross playing Tetris. What's the amiibo gazebo? When you scan an amiibo here, certain items will appear at random in the monster. Where's my amiibos? Lions all the way? Hell yeah. I figured you would have played this. Alright. Quest turn in. Oh, we have two quest turn ins. Right. You're a lifesaver. Uh, uh, there's a quest item over here, it looks like. Let's go this way.
Ooh, goodies. My goodies. My, my goodies. Why would the choir sign up? She'd be right there. What are you guys doing? Alright, so I guess let's see if we can teleport all the way back up here. Yes. Thank God for fast travel. My savior, thank you. Oh, let's sing. Let I like turning the other quest before we spend our time doing that. So, well done. You have my thanks. Ooh, we got a steel sword. Hell yeah. But it doesn't look like I can actually use it yet, right? Uh, actually, we can. Sweet. Alright, let's sing. <laughs> Singing is so much fun. Everyone should enjoy themselves while they're doing it. Don't make me have fun. You can't tell me what to do. Professor, let me sing for you. Do you not like my voice? It would make a Pegasus dance with joy. Ferdinand, honey. You could sing for me all night. Okay, so should I be careful about this part? It says they gain faith experience. Is there some people that I don't want to gain faith? It's a long day. Let's see what uh see what Dimitri has for us. That said, I hear you've been tasked with hunting down bandits, right? Meanwhile, my class is stuck with a downright peaceful. Well, I guess you should have won. Sounds like you'll be fighting alongside the knights too. Don't let the monastery down, Teach. We have only just arrived at the academy. And we're already being sent out to take care of bandits. It is a noble mission, but one that will likely require battle. In practice, there is little difference between a battle and a war. Even with the support of the Knights of Seros, we must still brace ourselves for the challenge. Do you have any other questions about life at the monastery? Or about battle? Just as students receive guidance from professors, professors may also guide each other. If you're interested, you should seek out Professor Hanneman or Professor Manuela. You can increase your skills by training with knights and professors in the monastery. Use the faculty training option to benefit from their wisdom. As the story progresses, faculty training will become advanced drills. Use this option to learn from any unit with a higher skill level than your own. Sweet. A student's house is determined by their place of origin, but naturally, each individual that said if a student so desires and their if you get to know the students better through the activities at the monastery they may approach you about this in practice it seems like that would be very very unfair everybody would like gravitate towards one house certain non-students will also become available for recruitment as the story progresses may I recruit professors it is better if you do not approach me. Dad? If you spend too much time around a man of Dusker, there will be rumors. Um, we're okay with that, you silver fox. Alright, I think it's time to end the day.
Let's have some fun now. If you don't yet know the proper procedure for lectures, I will tell you all that I know. Assuming that's agreeable to you, of course. I'll listen to you all day, Dimitri. When you instruct your students, they gain skill experience. As their skill level increases, they will gain access to new abilities and combat arts. The number of people you can instruct is indicated by your activity points at the top of the screen. When you set up a group task, the students you assign will continue the task until you change it. After the first round of instruction each month, month your students may come with, to you with a question. They will be motivated if they like your answer. Shit, I'm bad at answering questions. Before beginning a lecture, we would be most appreciative if you would first make note of our study goals. After all, everyone wishes to prioritize studying fields related to their goals, right? Students study on their own and earn skill experience according to their skill goals. Results are reported at the end of each week. You can alter a student's goals at any time using the goals menu. I believe you can ensure better results by instructing individuals based on their interests and specialties. Of course, that doesn't mean it's pointless to teach someone things unrelated to their goals. You never know if a student will develop an interest in something by overcoming their distaste for it. A three-star mark next to the skill indicates that you will unlock a budding talent after a certain amount of instructing. Once you unlock a budding talent, that person will go on to excel in that particular skill. They may even learn a new ability or combat art. Everyone's study goals will likely change based on the experience they receive from future instruction or assignments. When that happens, it would be greatly beneficial if you could advise us as to what new goals we should set for ourselves. As students improve from instructing and personal study, they may approach you with suggestions for new goals. Whether to accept their suggestion or not is completely up to you. Feel free to guide your students along paths of your own choosing. No matter how passionate you are about tutoring someone, it's difficult to get good results if that student lacks motivation. To increase a student's motivation, it's probably best to appeal to them in a variety of ways. <laughs> Gifts and food. If it's not too much trouble, I would be grateful if you would try to pay attention to everyone's motivation level. That sounds like a lot of micromanaging. I'm just here to kill shit. You can instruct students with high motivation more frequently. One way to increase motivation is to interact with your students around the monastery. Oh, we've definitely been doing that. Students are encouraged to engage in various activities in and around the monastery. By working together, students can strengthen their relationships and, in time, achieve better results more readily. You can assign one group task each week. Students who take part will earn skill experience based on your choice. You can also get gold and resources by completing these tasks. The results of a group task will depend on the student's strengths, weaknesses, and affinity for one another. Have you heard? Certification exams are held every month at the Officers Academy. Ah, uh, it's just like work. To become a new class, one must first overcome the certification exam for that class. Needless to say, if one lacks the required abilities, passing will prove difficult. I hope that you will plan ahead for the certification exams and instruct everyone accordingly. I think we have items for that too. When you pass the certification exam, you can change to new class. Benefits of high tier classes include increased stats and growth rates. Okay. Ah shit, I don't know what I'm doing. Uh... Or, I think... I think Dimitri was using lances and authority. Hmm. Yeah, we're going to work on lance and authority. Let's go with lance first. Although this would give us professor experience too. Coaching. Thanks. All right. 
axes and brawling. Where's brawling? Right here. I answered correctly. No need for praise. Hell yeah. Are these just random? Correctly. Whether they're good, great, or perfect? I answered correctly. What about our healers? Is this where they're gonna learn some heals? Probably. Let's make sure she can. Ooh, this'll. This is a three star. I definitely want to level up her faith. Now I feel like. Red. Yes, let's get let's get some aggravation colors in here. Come on, work. That's pink. There we go. Stable duty, yeah, let's let's put them all shoveling shit. Heavy iron or, or flying. I saw a lot of people that really liked riding skills. Let's go with that for now. Let's just keep it that for now. Professor, could you explain? I'm kind of terrified to walk the monastery grounds at night. It's unnerving how dark and quiet the place gets. How can I conquer my fear? Fairy torch? But that doesn't help the quiet. Training? Ah, oh, I see it now. Yeah. Oh, daddy. A week of, Let's of lectures? Hello? I am a little worried. It is done. Smithing stone, sweet. Whose birthday? God, they're gonna make me broke buying flowers for everyone. Thanks. Really, Raphael likes flowers. Unless they're an edible arrangement. <laughs> 